Hello Brahalers, Burton here with a step-by-step -step guide on how to do basic Qatar combos. I will break down all the reliable true combos that doesn't require a dodge and tell you when you can use them. To perform this combo, start with the side light, wait about half a second, then use neutral light. The period of time you have to input neutral light is only about one tenth of a second, so spamming light attack can work most of the time, but it is not very reliable. Therefore, it's best to practice the timing for the combo so you can do it by muscle memory, especially for legends with less than 5 dexterity like Sentinel and Queen Nai. This combo's range varies depending on the enemy's health. At 0 damage, you can hit side light at any range. At 30 damage, you can hit the side light from half range to close range. And at 90 damage, you have to hit the side light as close as it allows you to hit it. This combo is performed pretty much the same way as the previous combo, except you have to hold down after the side light to perform a down light instead of a neutral light. The timing is exactly the same as the last combo. The range also varies depending on the enemy's health. At 0 damage, you can hit the side light at mid range to close range. At 60 damage, you have to hit the side light as close as it allows you to. So overall, this combo is just a more difficult version to hit of the previous one and does less damage as well. To perform this combo, start with the ground pound on a grounded enemy. Wait about a quarter of a second after hitting the enemy, then jump into neutral air at the same time. The reason I say to time the pause after hitting the enemy is because the timing is always the same after you hit the enemy with it, but the timing varies before that based on how long you hold the ground pound for. The period of time you have to input jump into neutral air is only about one tenth of a second, and unlike the previous combos, there's two buttons to press, so mashing them both is very unreliable. So you need to practice the inputs for muscle memory. Pressing jump right into neutral air immediately is a bit hard if you have aim up and jump on the same key because you normally have to transition from holding down for the ground pound to up for the jump so I recommend changing jump to a dedicated button if you have this issue. My jump key is on space since my thumb is always resting on it. I can press jump and light attack at the same time very easily. On controllers, it's pretty hard if you're trying to press jump and light attack both with the tip of your thumb. So I recommend using the middle of the thumb to press jump on the bottom button and the tip of your thumb to press the light attack button that should be placed right next to the jump button. This way you can press both buttons in one motion. This combo works from 0 damage to 100 damage as long as you hit the enemy from above and not the sides. This combo is performed pretty much the same as the previous combo, except you have to hold down after landing the ground pound so that you do a jump down air instead of a jump neutral air. The period of time you have to input jump down air is about 1 8th of a second which is more forgiving but you still can't mash it since it requires two buttons at the same time. This combo works from 0 to 60 damage as long as you hit the enemy from above and you have to use down air when they are in front of you. If they are not in front of you when you hit the ground pound, then simply turn around by hitting the directional key opposite of where you are facing after the ground pound before using down air. I hope you guys find this guide helpful, please leave a like, subscribe and share the video with your friends if you think it will help them. Shout out to Bazillion for supporting this video and I will see you all next time.